that will come and take care of my mom hospital bill. Please, I don't want anything to happen to my mom. She's all I have. Please, God, I'm begging in the name of God. Mm, sorry, in the name of Jesus. What? Hey! Uh uh. Stella, you are here. How are you doing? I'm not fine. Where are you going to? I came to see my sister. That's your mother. What is she doing? None of your business. Did you bring the money for our treatment? If it's not bring it, oh yeah, baby dear. Carry yourself come out for this hospital because my mom doesn't want to see you. Why are you talking to me in this manner, little Stella? Eh eh, do not call me little Stella again. Am I lifting your eyes? Uncle, I just have one question to ask you and I will appreciate it if you answer me. Why are you wicked? Why are you such a wicked uncle? Answer me. Stella, what is this all about? Since when did you lose your manners? You don't have sense of listening anymore. Like, who is even feeding you with all of these things you're saying? Because you are too small to stand in my presence and be asking me stupid questions. Like, you lack home training. Look who is talking of home training. You think I will be afraid of you? Afraid of someone that will help to help my mom pay her bills. It's not that you just leave this premises, uncle. She might pass out if she see your face. Please go. Is it me you're talking to like that? I will just hit you now. Eh? Hit me. Hit me now. That's the only thing you have power to do. Help someone you cannot help. Sir, please stop. She's just a little child. How can a little child like this be talking to me in this manner? Are you not there from the very beginning? You saw how she was talking to me. Am I her mate? Sir, please calm down. This is a health center. You cannot just beat up a child here. Try and understand the poor girl. Eh? I am not poor. Again, me that is still starting life, you're saying I'm poor. Leave him to come and beat me now. Will you shut up, you this small girl? I will not shut up. Don't call me a small girl again. When an elderly person loses respect from children, what do you expect the children to do? Leave him if you want to beat me. Let him come and beat me. He thinks I'm afraid of him. Leave him. Hey! Uh -uh. You leave him. <laughs> Are you the one ranting that I should leave him? Just you actually want him to beat me and point of correction i'm not ranting uh -uh. Uncle, why is your body so strong <laughs> Uncle, good afternoon. how are you doing stella let this be the last time you talk to me like this if you try it again i will correct you in a hard way that you won't like sorry that was the old me this is the new me now Aww. you said you got to the hospital to do, to do what exactly I came to see your mom. Come and show me where she is. Why? Because she's my sister and I need to see her. Why? Because I love her so much. Why? Stella, <laughs> enough of all this. Why are you doing this now? Okay, I know what you want. I will give you money for biscuits while living. Don't worry. I know what your biscuits are beg. Just go straight like this. Then by your left, you will see her. Why don't you come and show me at once? You go go and be no go go. <laughs> You actually want him to beat me. Why did you leave him? You know not know that man is very wicked. You are the one that said I should leave him now. You are supposed to know that I didn't mean it. Ah uh ah, -uh. Stella, the direction you gave me leads to the doctor's office. Yes, I know. You have to pay her hospital bill before I show you where she is. <laughs> are you sure this is going to work? Me, I'm scared though. You don't have to be scared. Just follow my lead. Now you will take the call. Answer him with boldness and twist your voice to look like you look out. He might suspect if you just tell him to bring 2.5 million. So increase it to 4 million. Uh uh, that's too much now. I'm talking of the one you're doing and still doing another one. May I don't buy this idea. One thing with you is that you're always afraid. What's wrong with you now? You want to be him send 2.5 million and you don't know you will suspect. Instead of you to be bringing more idea on how we are going to make this mission successful, you're here clean the vibe I have already. I don't like it though. Focus, let's do this. You should have said 2.6 million, which is 4 million. It's very good now. Okay, the rest of the money, how are you going to do it? We will give it to the motherless baby soon if you don't need it. Um, but wait, why do you know this for me? Why do you want to help me? 
because me have checked. I have nothing to pay you back. Oh. Are you seriously asking me this right now? If you don't want me to help you, I can stop. Sorry now. I'm just being careful. Please continue. It's ringing. Once he pick it, you then tell him everything. Make it professional, please. If you get choked, you end the call is up. Okay. Hello? Yes? Who am I speaking with? You are speaking with kidnappers. We have a son here with us. Which of my son are you with, young lady? How many children do you have this man? James, of course. Ah, uh -uh. I thought James is inside. When did he leave this house? James! James! Uh -uh. It's true. So, young lady, what do you want? Look, Mr. Man, you have to cooperate with everything I say. Or else we will shoot your son. We are not here to joke. You will give us 4 million naira before we can release your son. Are you playing? Failure to do this. We will kill him and dump his body in the river. The choice is just to make. Calm down, kidnapper. You are rushing this whole thing. The truth is, I don't have 4 million to give to you. I don't even have half a million to give to you now. But this is what will happen. Let's say by weekend. Let me see if I will see where to borrow money. Tell him it's too far. Hmm? Tell him it's too far. Ooh. Daddy, please. Give them whatever thing they want. I'm not good here. These people are maltreating me. Please. James, I'm sorry. Don't worry. I will get you out of that place soon. Don't panic, okay? Hope they are not beating you. Dad, these people have really dealt with me. Bruises all over my body. Dad, please, bring me out of this place. I don't think I will survive here in the next two days. Don't worry, James. I will bring you out very soon. But you know, I already told you I don't have money now. How about you tell them that I will give them two million naira? Let me look for something to say. Dad, these people are not selling pepper now that you'll be pricing them. I don't think that we agree. So just get them the money. Hey, Mr. Man, time up. Do not mess with us, because if you do, you won't like the outcome. Get the money ready and get back to us. Please, don't hurt my son. I will get you the money. Please, make sure you give him something to eat. No worry. We'll go feed him, Gary. Bye-bye. <laughs> wait, wait. What kind of temptation is this one now? When did James leave this house and I didn't know? Wow, nice acting. You tried. You acted professionally. James. James. Hmm. I just hope this doesn't cast. Use your hair though. Me no go like go crazy. Don't worry. Nothing is going to happen. Don't be afraid. Okay, if you say so. I have to rush to the hospital now. Okay, no problem. Let's go. Go where? Ah, have you forgotten I'm now in your captive? Where do you want me to go? I'll go with you now. Ha, huh, James. Okay, let's go. My son, I don't know how my body is doing me, like I'm weak and it's doing me like there is a heavy block in my chest. I need to see the doctor. So sorry dad, have you been working lately? Maybe it's stress from work. No son, this one feels terrible. I don't know, I really need to see the doctor. Meanwhile, how did you go? You know I was hoping you are going to come with good news anyway. Yes dad, there is plenty good news. You know, I understand that all this happening to you is stress from work. But don't worry, very soon I will do what you ask of me, so I can take over the company and you can then rest. That's very thoughtful of you, my son. So is there anyone you're seeing? Of course, Dad. That's why I said I have good news for you. You know, as a wealthy and famous man, a lot of ladies will always want me, chasing me here and there because of their selfish interest. That's why I need to be careful with the kind of lady I choose. But I can bet you that this one I found now has it all. She don't even know me that will say she's coming close for her selfish interest. She's a good girl. I must tell you, Dad. That's very good. So when are you introducing her to me? Not to rush, Dad. Hopefully during the week. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, <laughs> what? Musa, Musa.
Sorry, sir. Sorry for interrupting you guys. I, the son of Mr. Okmara, the popular world business mogul, and the owner of Okmara and Sons Company Limited. Yes, is anything the matter? No, not at all. I'm a huge fan. I used to read about you on magazine. I'm <laughs> You're moving, but you're really not going anywhere. I know sometimes you feel the pressure to belong. 